Luna Game Zero, the spookiest of the spooky. Ah! Oh my god. What is that? Oh my god, run away from it. Run away! Oh my god, it's so scary. I'm wetting myself in terror. Oh my god, it looked at me. Oh my god, run. It's got so much mascara. Oh my god. Someone hold me. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna face you, foul fiend! Okay, we're gonna go into some kingdom and remember what friendship is like. This... This will surely end well. Let's just run off to the right side of the screen. We've got pretty much the same exact look from the first game. It's blocky clouds. Floating around. Oh, hello. Are you going to murder me? Hey there, princess. I'm sorry, I can't really talk right now. I'm looking for my books. I do such great voice acting. Oh, hello. Are you going to murder me? Oh, hello, princess. I'm terribly sorry, but I simply do not have the time to chat. I need to have a set of wonderful dresses by tomorrow, and I can't seem to find any emeralds. Chaos emeralds? Are you making a dress out of chaos emeralds? That would be kind of awesome, actually. I just... Hey, I got a book. Is it the Necronomicon? Did I just get... I just got the Necronomicon. Binky! Do you have ecstasy for me? You better. I paid for it. Oh, hi, princess. I have a special surprise planned for some pony. Yep, it's my ecstasy. But I dropped all the candy on the way here. You know, the, let's pretend this is a normal game thing. Kind of, you know. You, you can only do that once. We sort of lost the chance. Oh, hey, princess. I'm kind of busy right now. Some blasted little critter made off with all my apples. You think you could help me out? We just got, like, five freaking quests in a row. This is, like... Come on. Hey, we got... We got... Oh, right. That's probably what that book was. We got a Chaos Emerald. Let's go give it back so we can make a dress out of Chaos Emeralds and be super mega dress Sonic. For super... <laughs> the, the, the clouds are blocks. <laughs> That's hilarious. Can I stand on them? Oh, I better be able to. I'm not giving you Chaos Emeralds. I'm standing on clouds. Screw your dresses... I have clouds. I will make dresses out of clouds. You can't stop me. No one can stop me anymore. Okay, this got boring very quickly. Okay, let's just make some Chaos Emerald dresses. Oh, hey! Acceleration! Nice! We've got a pink ball of meat and an apple. Oh wait, so like, we are actually performing these tasks. I, I was not prepared for this. That's a nice fluid animation on the walking there. Oh, you found one of my books. Do you think- oh, crap. This really is an RPG, isn't it? And I can't move for some reason. Prepare for screamers. Oh. You're really milking the whole- this is a normal game thing really hard, aren't you? Well, two can play at that game. Fifty books?! Why do you have fifty books, and why did you spill them around this incredibly vertical, random outdoors area? What were you doing? How did this even occur? So, you can only play this game once, apparently, which is very annoying, especially since I have no idea what I'm doing. So I haven't played it before. And, um... I at least assume you can die before you do whatever you're supposed to do. How was I supposed to get up there? And especially if they're going to make me do all of these menial random tasks. That's going to be incredibly annoying. But I have a feeling spooky stuff is going to start happening before we get 50 books. At least I pray spooky stuff is going to start happening before we collect 50 books because I'm not, I'm not collecting 50 books. If these don't start turning into books made out of human skin... I'm going to be very disappointed. At least they can be made out of pony skin. I mean, that is the least that one could ask of. Really. Is that so hard? So, I would just like to reiterate that this is unnecessary and monotonous. Like, if this was a platformer that went quickly, I guess this would be okay, except it's really slow. And 
lame, but, um, you know. I kind of liked it better when you just got to the Screamers and got it over with. Because, you know, you've already, you know, you had one chance to pretend this is a normal game and scare us and, you know, that sort of thing. You're not going to fool me. And if the, the if it's a double fake out and th in reality you just made a normal game that is not scary, then I'm ac I actually hate you for that. And if that, I would be kind of amazed, but also kind of full of rage if that's what you actually did. I like how I can start running in midair. But I guess I have wings, so I could accelerate in midair. Spooky? That was not spooky. Can I even bridge that gap? I don't know if I was running. I don't know what to do. I could use a mini map or some crap. This is the worst mini game ever, by the way. <laughs> it's causing me physical pain with how annoying and pointless it is. We Oh yeah, I just did that. Because I can kind of walk on nothingness. Spooky time? Or is the game lagging? Now the game is light. I was hoping for a second there it was spooky time. Everybody loves the spooky time. Can I double jump or some crap? I can't get over there. I quit. Is there some way to die? Please let me die. Is there like a pony Kevorkian somewhere here? I need his services. Um, you could have at least made this short. Or at least made it easy and not get okay, suicide time. I can't even kill myself. Oh, I can't even kill myself. I hate this game. Like, seriously, what is going on? If screamers don't just pop out and murder me, I'm going to be very disappointed. Oh, there are the books. I was like, what the hell? I went through everywhere, but I apparently did not. <laughs> I'm still missing one. This is the worst anything ever. There better be another one right around here or something. There's not. Is there? Well, are you scared, kids? I'm literally wetting myself in terror and have been for the last, like, 20 minutes, however long I've been playing this ridiculous thing. This is the scariest thing I've ever seen. I mean, we've got platforms. We've got an amazingly blank blue sky. I mean, the sun and clouds have been destroyed. This is like post-apocalyptic everything. It's so post-apocalyptic that there's like nothing unusual about it. I wonder if I can fall far enough that I will die. This is, that's the point I am at this game. Um, seriously, where's that last book? I would murder the person of your choosing if you gave me that book. I'd rather murder you, but uh I suppose compromises could be made. Like seriously, what is this? When you at least got to the point, that was okay. It wasn't the scariest crap, but it got its job done and it wasn't ridiculous and stupid. But this Poorly is a poorly designed little level, and it's not fun even for what it is, and it's completely unnecessary to boot. So, if this last book is not made of human skin, I reiterate the fact that I will murder you. Okay, how do I? Oh, I must have got to go over here and go back up this way, and I have to hold shift the entire time to keep moving faster. The game keeps lagging, and each time I hope that something will kill me. When when I'm playing a game and I'm hoping that I will die, generally speaking, that means the game has done something wrong. Generally speaking. Like when I was playing Action 52, death was a sweet embrace in that game. And, oh, crap. And that's pretty much what it will be in this game. Because, you know... It's like all of the bad parts of a really boring RPG with all of the nothing of a horror game. 
Like, if you removed everything in its entirety out of Silent Hill, you would have this game. I'm, I'm pretty sure that's what you'd have if you removed every byte of data from Silent Hill 2. Oh, there's the last stupid book. That wasn't even there. That wasn't... I jumped across that stupid thing, didn't I? Did I jump over the book? Why am I even doing this? That book better kill me. I swear to God. I better die in less than one minute. I better see screamers. I better see poorly edited music. That's that's what I that's what I came here for anyway. Necronomicon, we're dead. Okay, that was close. The music stopped. Things are gonna get spooky, obviously. Seriously, what? That book just does not appear if you don't have forty nine. Apparently. Spooky! Oh no! He fell. Dun dun dun! It's a spooky horse. Dun dun dun, it's still a spooky horse. Okay. And, woo! Next level, even though there wasn't any indication that that was an exit. Oh well. Ooh, we've got some background music going here. I'm gonna regret turning up the volume when there's a screamer, but uh. Hey there, I got you your Necronomicon. Oh my god, if I have to do a mini game for each one of the ponies, I'm going to rip out your heart and eat it. Like, haven't they noticed that things are spooky? Like, here, I have Chaos Emeralds for you. <sighs> Great. She's gonna murder me, isn't she? She didn't even bring any ecstasy while she's murdering me, did she? That's just great. Hello, you're gonna murder me. Oh, hey, princess. I was just thinking about murdering you. See? Necronomicron, I told you. Murder. It's gonna happen. Spooky. Spooky. There will be streamers. Murder. Hats. Punch. Murder. Dancing. Killer. Okay. Wait, no. She's my she's my supplier. I can't kill her. That's that's just bad business practices. It's going to be so much fun. You're gonna tell me yeah. I see where you're going with this, but uh I just don't think I can commit to this. I mean, she didn't make me fetch 50 books. If anything, I should be killing Twilight right now. That was ridiculous. Can I go kill Twilight, please? Spooky. I murdered her, didn't I? But why? Yeah, I murdered you. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. And that was the end game. Zero. <laughs> okay, no, it wasn't. Sorry for murdering you, Pinky. Um, does that mean I launch the game again? Yeah, yeah. I knew there was going to be a screamer. The past cannot be changed! Oh, I guess that really was the end. Oh, oh well, that was... Well, one more time. That was Luna Game Zero, and we murdered Pinkie Pie for really no apparent reason. Like, seriously, why didn't we kill Twilight? Like, seriously, 50 bucks? What the heck? 